Alright, last time I was very out of focus. Let's try this again. What do you think about right? Yeah. Alright. My review on the Boss DS1 distortion pedal. Take two. I got this pedal about a month and a half, two months ago for just under 60 bucks, including taxes. I didn't get the wall plug in, which was a stupid mistake on my part. Within the first week of playing on this, battery died and I had no idea what was going on and forgot that they ran on batteries. So, went out to the dollar store, got two cheap 9 volt batteries. First one isn't dead yet, so it's pretty good. I guess in the shop they just demoed it to a point where the battery died. Um, it's, a, it's a good little pedal. It's very hefty. Metal. Shiny color too, I love the color, not gonna lie. Doesn't go too good with the rest of my setup, but the rest of my setup is pretty bland besides the custom painted wolf I have here, which I explain in a different video. Um, so I'll show you what the app sounds like right now with out the pedal turned on. I turned up the, uh, the drive a little bit so it sounds better while the pedal's turned on. So right now the clean, it's kind of like a dirty clean. It's good for it almost sounds like a really bad tube amp. <laughs> I, I, won't, I don't play clean usually on this this channel I have here, but I'll, I'll just show you for comparison. on the pedal right now. It's not what I usually play on, but again, just demonstrate the purposes right now. distortion tone, right? I'll show you what I play on normally. I turn the tone just past half. Distortion on about three quarters and level I turn just past half. Pedal is turned on. I don't know if you can see the settings right now. I hope you can. I already explained what they are, but just for the non-believers. for a comparison. I know it's a little break in between, but rewind the video, what, open a new window, just for comparison. <laughs> sounds like for lower, and I guess a little bit of higher with uh, the trooper, but for the most part lower riffs, I'll show you what it's like for soloing. It, it is an amazing pedal for that. I find that when you're playing lower riffs like Injustice for All, Creeping Death, Metallica, anything about Metallica usually, it, it's alright. Compared to my amp, it's, it's alright. This is my first pedal, so I don't know what to compare it to for pedals. I haven't played on any other as much as I have this. I've messed with... Um, Ivan has 
uh, tube screamers and whatnot, but I've never actually played a distortion pedal before, or any kind of pedal, besides wah. So, solo, which one should I do? These are my two best solos, by the way. string out of tune, but um, <laughs> yeah, as you can hear, the higher notes, they just get, they, they get absolutely rocketed out of the amp with this pedal. It's amazing. Keep in mind, I'm on a Spider 4 by Line 6, 150 watt. It's, it's a really, really good solid state amp, digital solid state amp, and I have no gripes about it at all, except the presets are kind of, eh, don't tell Line 6 I said that. Uh, I'll just sh I'll show you one more thing before I jam a little bit on the pedal. I find this pedal sounds it sounds all right with standard tuning at the lower end. It sounds amazing standard tuning for solos. But uh, one more amazing thing about this amp, in my opinion, when I tune it down to drop D, it has a certain amount of punch to it, which I, I love. Second try with this video, I, it's too warm to do a third, it's 90 degrees Fahrenheit, 31-ish, somewhere, it's, it's 31 Celsius, I think it's around 90 Fahrenheit. It's warm for Canada. Uh, let's, let's play one of my favorite songs to play, shall we? <laughs> Thank you. 
this overall out of 10 as a first pedal first distortion first any kind of real pedal for me like I said I'd give it a solid 9.5 the only 0.5 missing is from that lower end standard tuning a little muddy compared to my amp compared to most amps that I've played on but I still love the pedal I will definitely not be giving this up anytime soon hope you enjoyed the video and hope you take my words for consideration if you ever go to buy one of these good day